Welcome to the Hillsborian Historian. My name is Rex, and this episode focuses on the class of 1996. At this time, the Jefferson High School Alumni Association was trying to save the building that originally housed their high school. This building was also once the home to Hillsborough High School. The future of this building was extremely unclear at this time. Meanwhile, at the Big Red, many changes were underway. Coleman Bell became the first African-American principal in HHS history. There would also be a bunch of construction as a new media center was being added to HHS. Since the new media center would be placed on the old student parking lot, these students gained a parking lot located on Osborne Avenue. The construction would be just one of many things these students would have to contend with this school year, but they were intent on having a great year. This player needs a helmet. Here is the terrier mascot. Despite some of the construction distraction, the Terriers scored well on the SAT test. Sadly, on February 5th, which was the coldest day of the school year, students and faculty arrived to find locks on the school glued shut. Due to the vandalism, many classes were held in the auditorium. Vending machines were also vandalized. Some students pointed out that while they were dealing with this construction, they won't really get the benefit of it as they will be graduating. As always, these Terriers had a historic and fun school year.
Graduation was held at the State Fairgrounds Expo Hall. As they say in construction, I've got to bolt. Please subscribe to my channel to keep up with all of my HHS videos. Take care of yourselves, and as always, Go Big Red.